YouTube and welcome to Live with Felicia. I am kicking off my brand new channel with a possible full walkthrough of Dollar Tree. I say possible because I don't know how busy it is. I don't know how realistic it will be. So I just entered in. I'm going to do my best not to get any customers. Many states have a Dollar Tree, but if your, if your states or cities don't have one, I'm sure you have a similar store. So we are looking at some Valentine decor. I'm not gonna point everything out, but you see the ribbon and I see Gigum. I picked up this same ribbon several years ago. So it's a repeat and you see the stickers and the foiled or the glittered hearts and the mailboxes. Of course, everything here is a dollar. And then you have these types of mailboxes. These are cute, open with Velcro. And look at this, bells, heart bells, so cute. A lot of table decor window decor so these items once again they come back every year and you see boxes with the acetate windows those are fun and look at the scarves for a dollar more die cut hearts so items are still being put out let's pan this way so you could create a party cheaply with the items purchased at Dollar Tree of course you guys know that and, and take a look at the candy boxes different designs look at that puppy dog oh this brings back so many memories of childhood so this is the section that's dedicated to all things Valentine. Take a look at the Valentine Day cards. Now, you guys, I am thinking about hosting a Valentine Day card exchange on YouTube, just like we did when we were younger. Why should kids have all the fun? Let me pan this area. So I think I might do that. You guys be on the lookout for that. And when I say just like we did when we were in grade school, I mean you go out and you buy Valentine's Day cards, right? I'll have a class list <laughs> for all the participants and how fun it would be, how nostalgic it would be to do something like that as older people right okay so here you are looking at all of this is classroom things you could buy for your kids classroom for parties these are little sticker boxes how fun is that little embellishments you could put on your cards Look at the dinosaurs, so fun, so fun. And then down here, the rubber duckies. They have lips and hearts on them. And erasers. You got some containers down here. And for the girls, you have these little, these hair pieces and the sunglasses, so fun. And then you have paper doilies in different sizes pinks and reds and you see your paper and your napkins down there table scatter and table covers look at those felt die cut hearts and this is a great value these bags you don't you don't know how much I love you so cute and available in different themes and then these monkeys I see these too a lot uh, excellent price for a dollar. You could put together some nice Valentine baskets. And then, of course, balloons 
and I'm going to pan this way and you see all the just decorations for Valentine more boxes then you have your bag and then here you have containers Dollar Tree is great for things like that and on this wall these things come back every year we as crafters we could make that right but why when you can buy it for a dollar and look at these heart foams these are wreaths you could add your ribbon to those oh look at these die cut felt wreaths fun and then these are chalkboard and then on this side you have your hot and cold containers oh Christmas mugs these have candy in them I wonder if those are on discount so you got some Christmas stuff sprinkled in there and then you have all of the Valentine candy look at that got your chocolate creatures up there your bagged candy and my fave though I don't really like how these taste but you gotta love oh these are not conversation hearts they're a different type of conversation candy these are circles I think right yeah but they have a heart pattern on them so you have all the candies your kids loves down here. So I'm gonna speed it up a bit. You have all of these cards and they're two for a dollar. And then on this aisle, you have different colors of place party items. You know, I've been looking for this one item that I purchased last summer and it has not come back we'll see if i could find it so your gift wrap paper and your bowl you can't beat the price a dollar and let's turn and look at some of these nice quality so these are the baby gift bags and you have party gift bags and different and then here you have everything to plan your baby shower right so pretty and look at that ribbon that's there and more gift bags and solid colors there okay so they're putting things out okay wedding stuff right not a whole lot in this section some stores well, once again, they're putting so things I'm not out. doing this in order. I'm looking for the aisles that have no one. So you can find vases in different sizes. And then vase fillers. You see that there. The rocks and things like that. And then we get into the candles. Different sizes. Different scents. A lot of candles I like to pick up their tea lights but they don't last long no it says like 40 hours nah you might get a good strong um, 12 hours no it says like 200 hours it's like a lot of hours but you don't really get that many hours not strong light hours okay we got some crayons here so we are entering the stationery department you could find poster board in different colors only two for a dollar excellent price and I know a lot of you pick up the stickers they have they do get in different themes but you could find notebooks oh I need to get a planner too I'm gonna do it simple this year with the El Cheapo 2019 calendar I normally get mines from Amazon the eight and a half by eleven but I decided this morning I want to keep it I want it thin and I don't see those yet okay but you could pick up highlighters they have different types of 
pins. I like to use fine tip. I've never tried this particular pin before. All right, now let's walk back down the other side. So you have things for your, your kids, but you could use these stickers in your planners. But you see classroom items here for you teachers or you parents who homeschool. And then you have your office supplies. Oh, they have the metal ring tags. Those are cool. You get eight in account, eight for a dollar. And erasers, I hear customers behind me. There's folders. There's not a lot of walk space when they have those big containers out. Maybe I should walk this way. Yeah, I'll walk this way. And then you have a lot of frames. Look at all of those frames. A lot saturated with the frames. You know, I buy frames. I haven't in a while <laughs> because the frames I do have, I don't put pictures in them. I keep the actual, now this is beautiful right here. Love one another just as I have loved you. And this feels like a canvas. And I love the cross. This is pretty. I might get that. Yeah, but I keep um, like, <laughs> let me find one. Oh, I don't see any with the pictures in it. Yeah, you walk in my house. My family members look nothing like the pictures you see in the frames. And people who come over, they laugh at me. <laughs> I know I am bad. I have to put actual pictures in them. Okay, and more candles there. Okay, so you could find um, your all your paper needs here at Dollar Tree. I like to get mines from Costco. But they do have some, oh, I'm sorry. I just met, this feels like Tuesday morning. I just met someone named Kimberly. Hi, Kimberly. She stopped me because she wants to follow me on YouTube because she wants to see locals. Ah! <laughs> oh, nice meeting you, Kimberly. And by the way, you guys, happy New Year's, right? How did you guys celebrate New Year's? I was asleep when the New Year came in. Okay, and then you had your different plates and cups. Okay, I'm going to pan around because new one is in this aisle, and I'm trying to go as slow as I can. But let's pick it up, you guys. So you have baby bottles and baby pacifiers and bibs. Isn't that great? And then you could find... Now, I'm not too sure how well these socks work. I mean, they feel good. And some of the socks have the stoppers, the non-slip guard. Can't beat a dollar. And then you have gloves and then you have socks. Wow. That's great. And you get like three in a pack, right? And stockings. Now, everyone won't be able to find their color, their size at Dollar Tree, but they do have some. And then they have shoe polish things and um, the laces, more bags, more scarves. Uh-oh, shall I step in front of the mirror? Let's go ahead and do that. <laughs> okay, so you have different mirrors, right? To put on your makeup and then you have rollers. Now, do people still use rollers? I don't know. And a nice selection of combs and brushes and hair accessories. Hope I'm not going too fast for you guys. I'll get better at it, you guys. When I go back and watch the video, it'll be better. Okay, you have clips and things like that. And then you have the elastic rubber bands.
Okay, and on this side, VL5. Don't we all remember or know VL5? Now, what's funny about Dollar Tree and similar stores? I tell you, they do great knockoff words and designs because sometimes you look at it and think it's the actual brand name. Now, VL5, I'm going to consider that a brand. Oh, no, this is not VL5, is it? That's a Alberto. Is this the real VL5? <laughs> sometimes you can't tell. That's my point. <laughs> but sometimes you can find actual brand items at your local dollar type stores. Like Salon Selectives. I mean, it's not higher end, but I remember in high school using this brand. And Barbie? Is that a licensed Barbie? It might be. Only a dollar. So there's shoppers in this aisle, you guys. Okay, if you need to color your hair, well, you can find that here too. I had this weird, honestly, I've been telling you. And then, okay. So they have a little section. For African Americans, you see the caps and the brushes and some hair products. And then the bath items. You see the shower cap here. These are, I like these. These really do make lather. And your eye mask. So you have beauty products there. There are shoppers right behind me, so I'm trying not to get them. And then you have bathroom accessories like towels and shower rings and you see the, the cleaner containers there and shower curtains. And let's fill this to see. Okay, it's acrylic. It's not the like glass acrylic, but it is acrylic. But this is a good deal. Four of these for a dollar. You know what? I think I might want to pick up some of these. That's an excellent price. And look at the cute for your kids' bathroom, right? The cute soap and lotion dispensers. And then you have your mattress covers and some hangers. And then so your toddler eating supplies. And then you have your baby stuff, baby wipes, lotions, and even some baby so quickly food. gonna come down this aisle. I'm trying to film an order, but can't do that. Okay, so you see party, more party supplies on this side and themed by the way. I like how Dollar Tree keeps keeps their sections themed. And then more cards. And you see the love cards here. And then on this side, more cards. These cards are a dollar. And these are by Hallmark. And you have your party favors, things you could use at your kids' parties on this section. And if you like making flowers, Dollar Tree do have a selection. And then you have your wire wreaths and your flower all making. right this is the closet section you could pick up now i love these hangers i purchased mines from um hsn i forget the designer's name i think it's joy something she has them available in different colors and they really do transform your closet you can save a lot of space here you see um bags storage type bags this is the hardware section here you got some storage items 
acrylic storage items, organizers there, and then different baskets, packaging tape. I'm rarely in this section, but it's good to know what's available. So you have different types of tape down there. And then brushes for painting. Different stuff. Once again, all a dollar. Locks. And you know what? I do need some sandpaper. It would be in this section. And then gloves and a rope and smell good products there and mops and stuff for your car right power stirring fluid and gas treatment stuff fuel injection cleaner tire shine all right this is for the girls Fingernail polish and remover. You got makeup. LA Colors. I don't know if that's name brand. But it looks like it works well, right? A lot of different makeup to choose from. I used to get my makeup from Big Lots. I need to go there. I used to go there all the time. But you see the different selection of makeup. And then you got fingernail clippers and things like that and shower gel and razors. Now, it's a lot in this aisle here. So, you're gonna have to squeeze through. You got your lotions down here. <laughs> See that Dermaseal? I used to purchase a product that looks just like that. I walked in here one time and thought it was the same thing. Okay, um, coconut oil. Now this up here, I wonder, is that name brand? Because once again, you can find name brand stuff. I know Jergens is because I use their products. And this is good to have in your purse. And then down here you have your deodorants. You guys, it's a lot of stuff behind me, so. Speed Stick. I don't know if that's the name brand one. See, this one looks just like Secret. <laughs> now, Arm & Hammer is name brand, but I didn't know they make deodorant. Okay, Soft Soap is name brand. Look at Spa Soap. See, I buy that that one but it's not called well it's soft soap but it looks just like it <laughs> now zest is name brand and coast right is name brand and just because it's not name brand don't mean it doesn't work i once again get a kick oh look at this jergens that's hand washing liquid i get a kick off the designs of the knockoff and that oil allay oil is that one looks name brand yeah okay so you see the body washes here and then you see more toiletry type items there and oh this is cute look at that little boy there Okay, now, this section, if you, if you want, if you want to smell good, well, that's the smell good section, right? <laughs> I remember Jordash. And then you have bath salts or salts down there and lotions. And if you need to find out if you're having a baby, well, you could pick up a pregnancy test. And then hygiene items there. Oh, look at here. At home marijuana drug test, 99 or 98% accurate. Didn't know you could buy that. <laughs> and 
for a dollar. Okay, got you guys see those items there. Got cough drops and vitamins and medications, cough syrups, different creams, arthritis and muscle pain relief, athletic foot. Got band-aids down there, your alcohol and peroxide. Uh-huh. All right. Bandages and cushions for your shoes and mouthwash. Oral hygiene products and toothbrushes. So these items are name brand. You see Colgate and Crest. And close up is not bad either. I know we used that growing up. And AIM. All for a dollar. So Dollar Tree is like your candy central store. A lot of different candies. And I'm gonna walk briskly down this aisle. I would think it's one of the busier aisles. Look at all that candy. Now there is a candy that I could only find here and let's see if I could find it. They don't always have it. Okay, they have it today. I love these candies. The apple is so good. I love the ones that have the soft filling, the caramel, and well, they're all caramel, but the apple and this one here, love them. I pick up mines from Dollar Tree. So the aisle overfloweth with candy. And you could also find the sugar free right there. So let's get a, a view of this, this side is your drinks, your waters, and sodas. I don't drink soda. Gave up soda years ago, but sometimes when my family goes out to eat, you guys have heard me say this, I like to order a root beer with whipped cream on top. So you have your snacks here. Do you guys remember when Hostess announced that they were going out of business? This was maybe six years ago. I had not had a hostess in years, but when I saw that on the news, it was about midnight. I told my husband, we have to run to the market and buy some hostess because they're going out of business. My fave, I see it right here. Susie Q's, oh my goodness, we grew up with these. Then of course, it was on the news that I'm not sure what happened, but they were not going to go out of business. Because let me tell you, I was trying to stack up and freeze those. I'm so happy they're still in business. The funny thing is, I purchased Hostess products that during that time, just that one time. And then when I found out they were not going out of business... It's been, what, six years? I've purchased Hostess just once in the last six years. <laughs> See, when you think you're not going to have something, that's when you want it, right? <laughs> okay, so you see jerky sticks and in packs. And Dollar Tree is good because they have items like that. Like, when I get to the nut section, if I don't forget... I'll tell you what I'm talking about. But you could find some really good, like, snack. Oh, right here. Oh, you know what? They still have them. Do you guys like freeze-dried products? They still have these. But there's a product that I purchased that I don't see. I got home and ate it. It was so good. And let me tell you, I hit up, like, five Dollar Trees looking for it and haven't found it since. But I kept the wrapper. I hope I still have it so I could find it online. My point is, 
Dollar Tree will get some items in and not get them back in again. And had I known they tasted that good, I would have gotten a cart filled. But you can try freeze dried. Now I've been buying freeze dried products for years and it can be really expensive. I buy it in bulk, but Dollar Tree got the different, look at they have peaches. Okay, so when I'm done filming, I need to buy some of those. Those are good for your oatmeal, for your cereals. You could even bake with them. But you guys, they're the next best thing to fresh foods. Try freeze dried if you have not. It is so good. Okay, so then you have juices. Now I do buy juice. I buy 100% juice. And years ago, I remember when um, Dollar Tree or it could have been the 99 cent store. They had the half a gallon of grape, 100% for 99 cent. You could best believe I stacked up. Okay, so we all know what this is. These are chips. You will find some off-brand names. Like these are, I don't recognize these names, but you will find brand names too. Like this says good health. I don't know that's good right chips are not healthy at all but when you can find a healthier version like I like the baked the baked Lay's chips I keep those at home my favorites would be the cheesy ones okay you got nuts you guys and that product that I found at Dollar Tree that I couldn't find more of it it was a nut. It was in a bag like this, but a different color. And it was so good. Oh, okay, so the food good. aisle. I am surprised at how many people actually, when I say go shopping, their carts overflow with, with Dollar Tree items. I want to get to that frozen section to see what they have. But you'd see, you really could, you really could go grocery shopping on a budget at your local dollar store spices there condiments ketchups hot sauces barbecue sauces and then your pickles and then this side you have more snacks and cookies do you guys remember the moon pie <laughs> That brought back a memory <laughs> okay and then you have your fruits and baking some baking supplies sugar cakes and syrups a lot of this stuff once again is off-brand but hey I'm sure it's just as good as the name brand and then you have some canned items uh-huh and don't we all love noodles? Well, you can get, oh, look at the super meal down there. Hmm, I love noodles. One day I was just craving Roman noodles. Chow mein, teriyaki chicken. And these are the soups in a cup, and those are the bag. You guys, I make a dinner using these. I make Chinese chow mein and let me tell you when I make it it is a favorite I've made them for potlucks and things at church and they're gone really fast and then you have some canned okay this items. section is glassware I know a lot of party decorators who shop at Dollar Tree and similar stores to decorate party parties and tables so you could find jars, different types of glasses, salt and pepper shakers, and then here you have liners for your for your cabinets and drawers, chargers and different plates. Wow. And this is glass. This is glass. Yeah. 
nice selection to choose from on a budget. And then you have your thermals here. On this side, you have your breads and jellies, peanut butter, coffees and teas, cereals, breakfast items, instant oatmeal, Pop-Tarts, what they're called, toast them. Now, Wetchels, that's name brand. And then the Goldfish is also name brand. Oreo cookies there, name brand. Got puddings. Yeah, you could literally go grocery shopping and some at your local Dollar Tree. And then I love to use the disposable baking pans. I keep those stocked in my house. And then you have your foils and plastic wraps. So this is the last aisle. I think I may have missed one side of one aisle though. But you could find your storage like Tupperware. And this is Betty Crocker. I always see Betty Crocker products here, but you could find it in different sizes. These have the lids. These are great to store leftovers. You could even use those in your crafting. And then you have your plastic. I see Glad down there. That's name brand. And your trash bags. And then gloves. Reusable gloves. Oh, starting to smell good here because this is the cleaning aisle. So you see some cleaning products there. Not a bad price at all for items like this. There's one, okay, you know what? 99 cent store has that one item that I just thought of and I go there, I can only find it there. I could only find it for that price there, I'll say that. I've never seen it at Dollar Tree, but you have your different scoring pads there. And then, not a lot out today, but you could find dust pans and these mops are small, but the for job small done job. for small jobs. And then buckets. And let's look at the store from this angle. I didn't share the end caps, a lot of what's on the end caps you could find in the aisles. So this is the last wall and you see your cleaning supplies like your dish soaps. Ajax to me is a name brand. Dawn is definitely name brand. And then Palm Olive is also name brand. So those are really good um, deals for that soap. Comet is name brand. So you have your different cleaners here. I don't know how a lot of these products work. When it comes to cleaning supplies, I, I stay with the tried and true, which are the name brand items, because I need for my stuff. I need to know it's clean. And look at this, it makes five gallons Lysol. That's good. I need to get some of that. That is good. And I buy large sizes from Costco. Oh, and they have pine saw down there. Is that actual pine saw? Makes five gallons. I think that is pine saw. You know what? Yeah, I gotta get my shop on, you guys. Hope I remember. And then you have your small. I like Gain, though I haven't used it recently. Oh, and they have Tide and Downy. Those are all name brand products. Let's go up a little bit. And come back down. And then you have your Clorox, that's name brand. But you have your bleaches down here. And your softeners, your balance. And get down here. 
I have not used one of these and this particular type in so long in that shape but this is the smell good area if you want your house to smell good they have these I don't think I've tried the beads I guess you just put these like in a bowl and leave them out I use plug-ins and then I have the sprays and then I have the automatic dispensers oh they have the can sprays like I have a dispenser that uses cans like this you can never have your house smell too good unfortunately a lot of people are allergic to a lot of smells but here you have your linens for your kitchen you see the mittens and the pot holders you have a lot of different colors to choose from those mittens look like they get the job done a lot to choose from come down here and then you have baking items and the quality actually isn't that bad everything you need for your kitchen clips and the sink strainer silverware right salt and pepper shakers you have knives ice cream scoops and then you have um, your different spoons now I won't be able to get too close because there's a lot to my left but you see here you have your whisk mashed potato smashers different grips now I do buy these four of these for a dollar different sizes because I have different types of flowers like I have bread flour all-purpose flour um, wheat flour and other flours I like to keep a cup in my different flours so I come here to buy those I need to pick up more and look you have your grater and then I love these Betty Crocker scissors. I've talked about it in other videos. They cut fabric really good and you can't beat that price. So you see all, all the items you would need in your kitchen right here at... Okay, so let's take a look. This is what I was most eager to see. Um, it's the cold, the frozen section. And you see here, there's juices. Look at Donald Duck. There's juices, there's eggs. I don't remember who shared a video and I'm not even sure if it was Dollar Tree. But there were a lot of good items. I was like, I didn't know Dollar Tree had that. So here you have your cold cut meats down there. But I do know I came maybe a couple years ago and I know there's glare you guys you know let's open this part up and my husband he loves salmon and I found these individual salmon pieces and they were a dollar and I I only got like two got home and he loved it of course came back and couldn't find it Oh, if you make smoothies, those are great. Individual packs of fruit. Now, I do that at home with my own fruit. I use Ziploc bags, and I'll put everything I need into one baggie for my smoothies. But they have frozen. Oh, there's salmon down there, but that, that wasn't what I purchased. But they have frozen broccoli. I buy all of my veggies frozen. I don't do canned veggies. Texas toast, that's some good stuff. Meatballs, chicken strips, chicken sausage, apple infused. Now that's a good price if, if it tastes good. I buy chicken sausage. And what is this? Pork chop for a dollar. And what is this? chicken breast oh, okay and then here you got cream cheese pepper bites oh look at those crispy green bean fries I make those sometimes and if I'm out 
and a restaurant has them, I will buy them. They're really good. Got your individual burgers there, your Hot Pockets, um, potato tots, and then your individual pizzas. Oh, you really can shop, grocery shop at Dollar Tree. They just don't have a dairy section like milk. Okay, and then you see individual lunches and dinners there. And then the last one is ice cream. Ice cream, different types. And I think this is the aisle that I missed. Yeah, I think. It's the pet aisle. So you can even pick up things for your four-legged family members. I do like to buy dog treats from Dollar Tree. You can see they have leashes doggy food and water containers. We just passed the toys, the doggy pads, the bags to pick up their mess. You see canned foods down there. And then you have these chewy um, bones and things that your dogs can chew on. And let's see if I could find the ones that I like to get my dogs. I don't see them. They're not always in stock. They last a long, well, they last about five days. To me, that's a long time for my two big dogs and they just love them. But like I said, they're not always in stock. Oh, I need to pick them up some more. I'll try the other Dollar Tree. And then here you have floor mats for your car. I'm assuming those are for your car. Yeah, because the car stuff is on the other side. And then you have wall art. Look at that. And then here, table decor, I guess. And then baskets, laundry baskets. So this section needs to be restocked. What is this? Window decorations there. And then here, batteries and such. And then light bulbs, different sizes. It needs to be restocked. And different lightings, plugins. I see some ear mud, earphones there, phone chargers, tablet, I guess chargers too.